change. So I'm here with Emily at Juilliard in this lovely harp haven. I don't know if you can uh, get an appreciation for how many harps there are in this room right now. She is playing one of them on my album. Why don't you tell us uh, a little bit about your instrument and uh, just walk us through it. Yeah, absolutely. So there are 47 strings ranging from, we've got C on the bottom, all the way up to a G on top. They are made out of gut strings up here and then Ooh, the bass yummy. wires are made out of um, metal. There are seven pedals, one for each scale. So it's a D, C, B, and then E, F, G, A. The, the pedals are kind of like the black keys on a piano. So when you move, for example, when you move the G pedal, um, you push it down and it's connected with a series of rods that come up through the column, which is hollow, and then extend through this, which is called the neck. And actually, if you look under here, you can see the mechanisms working as you push down the pedal. Oh, wait, yeah, 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 really small. Yeah. I do see that. Very cool. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. It moves a disc up here, which then tightens the string, which raises the pitch a half step. Oh, and then if you move the pedal down one more time, another half step. And so that's how we do all accidentals or key changes. They're done with our feet. Key uh, changes. Harp weighs about 90 pounds. There are 2,000 working parts. So how do you tune do a harp? So you take a tuning key um, and the tuning key goes in the pins at the top of the string. And then to sharpen the pitch, you go this way. And to flatten it, you go this way. And you do that for every single string. Well, wow. Which is why we're always tuning. Uh, can you play me yeah. something that you're working on? Oh, easy tricks. <laughs> 